Hello and welcome. We're going to create a shell strip with like a Windows batch file by opening Spotlight, finding Terminal, and running Terminal. Once Terminal is running, let's type in the command ls to see what files are here. And then to create a file, we use the nano function and type the file name. We want to create a file called myscript.sh. That opens up the nano window, and let's type in some commands here. Echo, space, gives us a blank line, echo and a message. This shows the script executed, and then echo and a blank line so we can see it when it runs. Now, control X to exit, and then select Y to save the modified file, and then hit enter to save it with the file name you gave it, myscript.sh, and we're back in the terminal. Now let's ls again, and we can see that myscript.sh is right there. So now we need to give it execution rights by typing the command chmod plus x, the path, and the file name. When you're working in Windows, you don't need to give it permission, but in the Mac environment, yes, you do. So this is important. So chmod plus x slash users YouTube slash and the script name myscripts.sh. Once you do that, the file has execution rights. Now, file still looks the same. Now we go ahead and execute it by typing dot backslash myscript.sh, and there you have it, a blank line and a message that shows the script executed and a blank line. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.